we're here on the muddy Missouri River conducting research on living dinosaurs. For over 70 million years, paddlefish have graced Montana's landscape. However, we still know little about their behavior after being snagged and released. To gather this data, Montana FWP biologists replicate the same method that anglers use when snagging these prehistoric fish. What we're gonna do is we're, we're trying to hook these fish, bring them to shore. We're taking a bunch of biological data um, from the fish. We're documenting the fish. Once caught, fish. biologists will start a timer until the fish is released. Swinging the fish down current and using the same tools of removing a hook and managing the line is applied. Just watch the hooks are on the, by the head there. After securing the petal fish, biologists will quickly transfer the fish to a water tub to gather biological data. Uh, so what they're doing right now is taking the ultrasound of the fish. Essentially what this is gonna allow us to tell is how close this, this female is to actually going and depositing her eggs. This fall, the paddlefish will be netted to provide additional biological data, including if there was a change in spawning behavior, if any at all. Montana FWP, along with partnerships of Montana State University and Northwestern Energy, will continue this research for the next two years. This study will ensure recreational opportunities and the survival of this prehistoric fish. I'm Lauren Carnup, and remember, the outside is in us all.